Hi, iHeartRadio. I'm Lauren Allred, and I'm a singer-songwriter, and I'm here to show you my favorite holiday recipe called Magic Cookie Bars. So, to get started with the Magic Cookie Bars, make sure your oven is preheated to 350 degrees. Then, you want to melt one stick of salted butter and put it in the bottom of your pan. By the way, this recipe calls for a nine by 13 inch pan, which I do not have. I have a larger pan, so I increased everything by 50%. But don't worry because everything I'm telling you is for the nine by 13 inch pan, but feel free to adjust accordingly based on how big your pan is. So next, you want to take one sleeve of graham cracker crumbs and spread that evenly over the melted butter. Then you want to take one can of sweetened condensed milk, drizzle that evenly. I don't know if any of you have tasted this, but it's the most delicious thing. Then after the sweetened condensed milk, you want to take one to one and a half cups of milk chocolate chips, or you can use semi-sweet based on how you like it. Drizzle those evenly on top of everything. Then after that, you want to take one to one and a half cups of shredded coconut. See, this is so simple. Anyone can do it. And it might look sloppy now, but after it's out of the oven, it looks totally gourmet. <laughs> then after that, you want to take one cup of chopped pecans. The great thing about Magic Cookie Bars is that it's really sweet, but it also has a salty and nutty flavor to it. So it's really balanced. Then after everything is layered like so, you want to take your spatula and press everything down. So the butter and the sweetened condensed milk gels everything together. So it's perfectly ready for the oven. So I'm just going to stick this into the preheated oven at 350 degrees and I'll show you the final product in just a second. Okay everyone, we are back with the magic cookie bars after 20 to 25 minutes in the oven. And as you can see, I already took a taste test and I can assure you they are so good. So I hope you guys enjoy this holiday recipe. It's super simple and delicious and I'm wishing you guys a very happy holiday. Take care. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. Did you like that video? You can check out more over here. And don't forget to subscribe to iHeart right here. And if you're already a longtime fan, make sure you ring the bell down below so you don't miss a single video. Bye guys.